Houston, say again, please. Uh, Houston, we've had a problem. Hey there folks, welcome you all to part 2 of Skyrim on the Xbox Series X and with the FPS boost mode on and we're going we're gonna to take a, a wander up to Bleak Falls Barrow and just get, you know, get a bit more action in see how this boost mode copes with everything It's really annoying that we can't get Gerdur to... We're a small village, but we work hard and take care of our own Get rid of these do you have supplies? Of course. Take what you need. There is something you could do for me. For all of us here. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. There you go. That's what wouldn't happen last time. I'm pretty sure you can't kick the story on without that either. See if there's any goodies in here for us, just in cases. It's a good place to store some stuff, though, before you get a house. Right, we're good to go, I think. Dude, how you getting on, Ralph? I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. You really think I should join the, the Stormcloaks? With Ulfric Stormcloak, even. You don't have to be a Nord to fight for Skyrim's freedom. You should come to Windhelm with me and join the fight to free Skyrim. You've seen the true face of the Empire here today. If anyone will know what the coming of the dragon means, it's Ulfric. You make a good case, maybe I will go to Windhelm. I hope so. Skyrim needs people like you to fight for her freedom. Come on. Better get moving. What? Where are you going? Right. Let's be on with it. Normally at this stage I would make some blacksmithing stuffs actually. Uh, but we can do it any time. And it's night time now. So. Oh, moon. Look at the size of that bloody moon. <laughs> Large much? Actually, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll just quickly pop into the pub, because normally there's a few quests kicking around in there. Isn't the Sleeping Giant Inn. I'll tell you, the one thing this has got much better is uh, than the PlayStation 5 is the loading screens are ridiculously Hard fast. To. The ale is going bad. We need to get a new batch. We got rooms and food. Drink, too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. Heard any rumors? There have been whispers. A boy up in Windhelm, name of Aventus Aretino. Been trying to contact the Dark Brotherhood. Down with Ulfric, the killer of kings. On the day of your death, we will drink and we'll sing. Okay, thank you, my friend. Until next time. Did you hear me? Yep, Ale's going You're that visitor been poking around. Heard any rumors, Delphine? Word is Ulfric Stormcloak escaped from the Imperials. War is only going to get worse now. Well, that didn't trigger anything, did it? Right, come on, let's go. Let's get out into this world. Now, I should... Hello. It's my business to keep track of strangers. I should say at this point that I... I said in the first part that I was sure that the uncapped mod didn't have stickiness at that first section when I had played it the last time in Xbox Series X. However, I didn't start using that mod until about halfway through my playthrough, so it was a bit of a false suggestion. So let's see how we got on. So far, it's very smooth here. We're going to go to Bleak Falls Barrow for the Golden Claw. Well, the thing is, it's, uh, it looks beautiful up here. Free leather. That'll do it. Pretty 
pretty sure we've not had an up. We've not had a level up, have we? No, we've not. How far are we from one? I told you it's the bottom there, Stephen. Yeah, not too far. Level two. Blimey. That'd be a big jump. <laughs> Most likely I'll put that on me. Destruction and restoration first. Yeah, so, I mean, already it's feeling a bit sticky up here when things start getting a bit moving around in the air. You know, floating snow and such like. Pretty sure there's some bandettes up here. You say a bad time to get lost, friend. Someone's coming at me. Someone's behind me or shooting arrows at me. Level up time. Level up and ride your pony. You dead? Oh, nice. Oh, nice. You get the speech craft from that early on. Sweet. I do like the hide armor, has to be said. <clears throat> Well, the steel war axe is probably better than what we're using at the moment, I think. Weapons. I didn't sell my, uh, didn't sell the bloody <laughs> weapons I picked up when I in the first section. Well, it's ten for the war axe and nine for the sword, so seems reasonable. So yeah, I mean that that whole panning around, you can see it sticking. Not that you're going to spend the game doing that, but it just takes away from the experience. No, now we need to do our level up. I knew there's a reason to come up. 61 shiny gold. Yeah, I mean, I feel that the all of the caves and stuff are going to be fine. It, just, it feels like it's just struggling with this outside world. I feel like maybe they could just... I don't think that they've dropped it to 1080p, and I think they could possibly rein the graphics in even more than they've done in order to smoothen things out. There, that's fine. It's more when there's a lot going on, like there. There, that is really sticky. I mean, the the mod on the PlayStation Five is not struggling at that level at all, at all. And I'm telling you, like, I'm convinced that the uncap mod for this is is better than what this is doing at the moment because that that is just extremely extremely sticky look at it and this is one of the lighter areas really bleak falls barrow it's just beautiful isn't it 
picture. Oh, we've not done our level up. Silly boy, we'll do it after this. Axe time! You're rip. You'll what, sorry? <laughs> I hate those shitty bows you get at the beginning. Steel hammer. Why don't you call my name? There's always one. Keeps going, even though they know they're going to lose. I'm going to put you down! Damn you! I'll do some panning for you, just so you can see what's going on. Not too bad from up here, right enough. Seems smooth enough. Right, before we go in here, I think we'll level up. Level up and ride your pony. Here we go. Well, I think we'll most definitely put it in the hell first. Eh, uh, or magicka. Novice destruction spells for half magicka. Well, it's that or the restoration one, isn't it? That's what I'll go for. I think I'll go for the fire because I'm not using it for that reason. Destruction. Which means I can start using it a bit now. Do the restoration one next and then bit one handed. I often try and sneak up on these badgers and use me bow and then I get myself all in a tiz. Took a lot of his health off though, to be fair. That was a brutal attack, wasn't it? Studded armor. Nice. Going to avoid picking up weapons and general armor if I can help it. Well, we can put that on. Not got anything else for now. 22 for the hide. 25 for the studded. Yeah, put that on, I think. For the look of it. And it's got the same armour on it. Fifty-two gold. Oh, there we go. Magicka regenerates twenty-five percent faster. Well, I'm going to want to put that on now, aren't I? Without any shadow of a doubt. Bit of a boon. Yeah, I mean, inside the inside these caves and buildings, absolutely gorgeous. Really smooth. It's 
It's pretty spidery down here, isn't it? No, no. Empty. He dies when he pulls the lever, doesn't he? <laughs> that was a terrible way to go, dude. I was going to warn you, but you wouldn't have listened. Mm, I think I've got a steel sword. The axe is slightly stronger anyway. Hey, yes, here we go. So we need snake, blah, dolphin. Well, it's a whale, I think. As I've been told many a time by people. Snake, blah, dolphin. Well, snake, snake, dolphin, I think you'll find, Steve. Or whale, <laughs> as I keep getting told. Hello, marvelous, thank you. I think we get attacked from this. Uh... Nice pickpocket and increase. I think that's our first soldier, isn't it? Skeevers. I'm sure there's skeevers down here. <laughs> Fuck's sake. Pretty sure it's those that give you that bloody rotting shit joint or whatever it's called. Rock joint. Whoa. See this, that's awesome. When it's really smooth like that and you walk into an area like this. It's brilliant. Oh god, I hate spiders. Oh! <laughs> Gotta fight a bloody massive one now. Well, I'm glad I put it on my destruction. For half magicka. Fuck. Holy shit, I'm getting hammered. <laughs> shit. Oh, I'm out of potion. I'm out of magicka even. Right in there, dude. Get me out of here. Touch of the Frodo's, aren't you? <laughs> Help me out of here. 
pretty sure you can fall down that. Arville the Swift. You did it. You killed it. Now cut me down before anything else shows up. Sure, you look like a trustworthy type. Where's the golden claw? Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door in the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. Help me down and I'll show you. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Hand over the claw first. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. It's coming loose. I can feel it. <laughs> yes, you were about to run away. I know you were. The Golden Claw, thank you. Arvel's Journal. Find the secret of Bleakfold's Barrow. Hide helmet. Hide boots. Hide braces. Might be more in keeping with what we're actually uh, doing with the uh, hide armor and stuff. Apparel. No, there's seven and seven. Yeah, a bit less, bit less armor on the hide stuff in there. No, every time. It's empty. Another level up, nice. Whew. Often have a bit of coin these drogas. The Skyrim helm, as we like to call it. To this day, can't quite figure out which ones I know will have pickups on them or not. Well, it's studded in light, isn't it? Let me take it. Get some coin for it. Let's do our level up before we do that. Gonna stick with the Magicka for a time being. For the next destruction, we need 25. It's not, not that bad. Let's get our restoration for half magicka. 
so that's healing and fire sorted for half magicka, which is awesome. There was one up here, I yeah, recovery was the one that I missed. I totally didn't realise was there. At 30, you can get 25% faster regeneration. He's taking a bit, isn't he? Oh, fuck. Need a top up of magic here. Fuck. <laughs> Fell into my trap, you muppet. Where the fuck did he go? <laughs> Where is he? That's not him, is it? Could be. Christ. <laughs> Thought he would have got flung over here somewhere, but I can't see his body. Nice. Ooh, that made me chuckle. Shiny. Did we search that dude? Did we walk past him? Hi. Ow. Pretty sure we get another dude in it. End of base. 35 gold, what the shit? That'll do it. For him anyway. Dude, you didn't even make it to me. I <laughs> uh, love it when a plan comes together. Seem to wake them all up at once, isn't it? Is the guy going to come out of here? Right. 
Destruction increase. Stop picking up bone meal, Steve. Skeletons. Fill down first. See, even that, you know, lots of moving water and everything, and mist in this section is absolutely smooth, no problem. Buttery smooth. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. Draugr Inferno. There we go. He guarding anything, this guy, was he? Oh yeah, there's a chest. Bleak full sanctum. <laughs> nice. On the head. I 
Well, the bow's better than the shitty one I've got. Might as well take that. And the arrows. Yeah, six that one and the... It's nine. Way across. I feel like that trap must be there for a reason, surely. <laughs> Bit of an old place to put it, unless they were stood up there before. mistake it's a real Indiana Jones moment that isn't it? it's great right the iron claw oh, sorry the golden claw bear moth owl Sesame. Here we go. Whoa. Bats. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's going to be people jumping out of all sorts of places. Oh, that's empty. There's certainly one big dude in it. Oh, and a dragon wall, thank you. Check that out. I mean, this is all buttery smooth, it really is. Really nice indeed. I remember this guy come out after I get my shout. Must be. Unrelenting force. Here he comes.
fucker. And a level up. And the Dragonstone, which is part of White Run, asks you to get that. Ooh, frost damage. And level up. Just amazing those Dragon Wars, aren't they? Fantastic. Warhammer, Garnet. 77 gold. Oh, restoration spells cost 12% less to cast. We can stick that on. We've not got another decent ring. Equip. Hide helmet. Pretty sure there's a couple of chests kicking around the back. Memory serves. Come on now. Aye. Garnet. Some decent loot in this section, to be fair. God damn it. Well, I feel like there was definitely something on the other side. Maybe not. Yeah, there is. Look, there. It's behind the water. And there we are, folks. Bleak Falls Barrow's mystery has been solved. We're sticking a health on at this point. What's the first smithing one? Create steel armor and weapons. Yeah, might be worth it, Rhino. Not sure there's a light steel, though, is it? It's the... Hmm. Yeah, it's the scaled one. I always end up on scaled. For a, a fair while, anyway. And improve them twice as much, mind you. Twenty percent more damage with one-handed. Probably worth doing the smithing one just to get going in it.
tell you what, you get a fair bit out of this area. It's well worth doing this before going to Whiterun. <laughs> it wasn't even three seconds out to get out outside. Where the bloody hell is that on the map? Yeah, I mean, coming out of there is nice and smooth. But there's not much going on in the air, you know, not nothing blowing around like snow or mist or whatever. Still gorgeous, though. That's where we're off to. Yeah, but that's Bleak Falls in. Yeah, cleared. So we've come out the other side of it. Bloody hell. Well, I suppose teleporting back to Riverwood to do the... to give this the claw back, isn't it? Hey, Lucan. You find the claw, the sooner our lives can get back to normal. I've already done it, dude. I have the claw. You found it. Hi. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm going to put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. <laughs> it's smaller than I remember. Look at the bloody size of it. it means well, before I go selling your stuff, I'm most definitely going to put on my speechcraft amulet. So much to us to have the claw Thank you so home. much for taking trinkets, odds, odds and ends, that sort of, sort of thing. thing. Yes. Well, I'm probably never going to use that sword, which is a bit. Well, yeah, it's nine plus five. Although, we could uh, collapse it when we get to Whiterun and get the thing off of it. Don't need four of them. Or any of them, to be fair. Four of them. Or that. Or that. Or that. Uh, might hang on to the sword, because I might improve it. Some decent coin in it, hundred and seventy six. Oh, look at our gold, We're already up to 2,600. Nice. Mm. Interesting, he lets us take coin off the desk, look. You and me, we're the only people around who aren't complete fools. Let's just take that sword. The river let's just take coin. <laughs> let's just take that. Store. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. It's worth looking around the shops because you are allowed to pick up certain things, not classed as theft.
Right. Well, if that's not an ideal place to wrap it up, I don't know what is. Yeah, I was far more impressed with that part, to be fair. Even though there was still a couple of sticky moments. I mean, it still looks gorgeous. Uh, it's just a little bit on the sticky side when things start kicking off with the weather and stuff. But you can see it there a little bit. When you look up at the clouded mountains and stuff. And when you go up and down across that smoke coming from the fire, so... Not perfect, but still better than 30 FPS. By far. Well, there you go, folks. Hope that's helped somebody out, seeing it, the FPS boost mode turned on. It has been an honour and a privilege serving for you once again in Skyrim on the Xbox Series X. And I'll catch you in the next one, folks. Take it easy. Bye.